Welcome to Mr. Woods Teaches. I'm Fred Woods, ready to teach. All right, boys and girls. Hey, today we're working on magnetism. But before we start the magnetism you know, uh, lesson, we need to get into here, and I have this package. I got this package. You can order it online, and I'm going to show you the contents of this. So let's open this up. So I open up the box, and I'm pulling out. You know, there's some directions here, because, uh, you know, what different pieces I have and you know some experiments and it says here fun with magnetic car use of the compass and such but let's take a look at what we have here so I'm going to pull out this box look at that we have looks like there's uh, directions also in Japanese look at that wow I have some stickers Oh, or wait a minute, that could, they could be magnets. That, I'm not sure if they're magnetized or not. A little bit of foam, I'm not sure what that's for. Maybe for when we're creating our own uh, compass and such. Looks like some metal filings. Okay. I'm not quite sure what all of this is, but it looks like it goes like that. I'll figure it out. And then, oh, I think I have some mag, you know, a magnet here. Yep. Little magnets here, a couple of bar magnets. So you notice how it has uh, the, let's see here, N for North Pole on the magnet, which is actually, uh, this is uh, points towards the South Pole. I'm sorry, this is the, actually the South Pole because if we're looking at it as um, a magnet, this end points towards the North because it, its polarity is South and then the South Pole is blue. So see how they go together like that? And they don't want to go together like that. Okay, that's cool. Uh, what else do we have here? Oh, I have some string. Uh, looks like some plastic pieces and some paper clips and nails. There's a compass. Let's take a look. Let's see if it's, yeah, kinda. Let me move this around to where it's pointing north. That's about right. You know, I've, I've done some other experiments inside this room, and that's about right. I have a wooden dowel. And then it looks like there's some ring magnets. Look at that, see? Blue and blue, no. There we go. Uh, oh, this looks like it's some sort of wand or something. I'm not quite sure what that is, but uh, I'll have to check that out. I have a horseshoe magnet. And again, notice we have a north and a south side. See how it goes. And if we take a, one of the bar magnets, see how it, they go together like that. But if I turn it around, it's like, no, I don't want to. See, it doesn't want to mix. And then there's a couple of cars. And it looks like they're made out of a uh, bar magnet there. See how they have the wheels. And so we're going we're gonna to use all these different pieces to uh, go through several experiments. I have some of my own magnets as well. Um, one of them that I've had for a very long time since I was uh, 11 years old. So that was many, many decades ago. So until we get started, this is what we have. You can get it on an online uh, retailer such as Amazon or there's others that are out there similar. I picked this one. It looked like it was pretty complete for all the pieces that we're going to need for our uh, stations for magnetism.